you're considering a move to Richland Chambers Lake and you're curious to know what the real estate market is like here so you can know what to expect. Well, you've come to the right place. We are going over the real estate market of Richland Chambers Lake for May 2024. We are going to break down the lake to the three towns that surround it. Of course, Canada, Streetman, and Currents. And keep in mind, what we are discussing are waterfront residential homes. We're not talking about off-water. We're not talking about raw land here. Waterfront homes. And if you're new here, my name is Mariah Zuniga. I'm a local real estate agent and a resident here on Richland Chambers Lake. And I help people just like you who are looking to make a move to Richland Chambers Lake a smooth one. You can check out additional videos on our channel telling you all about Richland Chambers Lake. So make sure to check those out and like and subscribe. But here we go. Let's break down the market trends for Corsicana, Kearns, and Streetman. Let's dive in. First up, let's take a look at Corsicana. In May, we saw 12 active properties on the market with an average close price of $820,000. Homes here are selling fast, averaging just nine days on the market on average. The average list price is quite high at $1.5 million and with 2.5 months of inventory. It's definitely a competitive market still on the Corsicana side of Richland Chambers. Six new homes were listed and we've had five past sales here in May. Compared to last year, there were slightly more active homes, but the market remains hot with sales and quick turnarounds here. Now let's talk about Kearns. This month, there were four active properties and one on the market that just hit. The average list price here is a staggering $12 million, which is that one new property that hit the market. This one is beautiful also, and it sits on over 20 acres waterfront of course however there were no sales in may compared to last year the market saw a shift with the fewer active homes but more sales back then it's a unique market with high-end properties offering that luxurious lakeside living for sure and currents moving on to streetman in may there were nine active homes with an impressive average close price of 1.7 million homes here took a bit longer to sell averaging 110 days on the market and that average list price was 1.3 million and with 4.5 months of inventory on the streetman side it's about more relaxed compared to corsicana for sure two new homes were listed here and we saw two sales Looking back at last year, the market had a quicker turnover with slightly lower prices, but it's still an attractive area with a ton of great potential. So what does this mean for you? If you're thinking about moving to Richland Chambers, now is a great time to explore your options. Each area offers something unique, as Corsicana is a bustling market with quick sales and a range of luxury homes. Currents, you have high-end listings offering exclusive and luxurious waterfront living. You will see a lot more properties here actually on larger acreage as well. And streetman side, a mix of premium properties with a bit more time to make your decision there. But that's not all. Let's talk about currently on the market as well right now. Corsicana, there are 11 properties available right now. Here's the breakdown. Six of these homes are listed over 1 million ranging from 1 million to 1.6 million. These luxury properties feature four to five bedrooms and they range from 3,000 to 4,200 square feet. They sit on spacious lots from half an acre to 2.8 acres, often in the most sought after subdivisions on Richland Chambers Lake. There are also five properties priced between $500,000 and $800,000. These homes offer three to five bedrooms and vary from 1,400 square feet to 3,000 square feet, sitting on lots ranging from 0.3 to 4.4 of an acre. Again, those are waterfront. Moving on to Kearns, you'll find four unique properties. A standout $12 million ranch that spans 37 acres, perfect for those looking for an expansive and private living. A 2,000 square foot home priced at $715,000, sitting on 1.22 of an acre. Two charming tiny homes located in the Peninsula Point subdivision as well. And in Streetman, there are six homes on the market. These homes range from $1.8 million to $3.5 million, featuring three to six bedrooms and expansive spaces from 2,400 square feet to 5,200 square feet. They sit on large lots from an acre all the way up to 7.4 acres, offering plenty of privacy and room to enjoy the lakeside lifestyle on the south side. Additionally, there are three more affordable options priced between $535,000 and $749,000. These homes range from 1,600 square feet to 2,100 square foot, and they are sitting on lots about 0.4 of an acre to 1.2 of an acre. So whether you're looking for a luxury estate or a cozy lakeside home, or even an income producing opportunity in Peninsula Point, there is something here for absolutely everyone. If you have any questions or you need more information, feel free, reach out to me. I'm here to help you find your dream home here on Richland Chambers Lake. Thanks for watching. See you next time.